Hello guys, today we continue apologetics asetony. So in the last video, we talked to our client, but she doesn't talk much. She just she just gave us a business card to the Drew Drew Studio. Okay, this press this load. Three, I forgot. Okay, move. Hmm. Okay, the studio. Hmm, this place reminded me of something. But you know what? Okay, October 7, the studio. Wow, this looks like... It looks like a studio. It's like life imitating art. Or maybe it's the other way around. Hmm? But the tape on the ground there, it's a bit jarring. Yeah, looks like we found our crime scene. Apollo, look at all those paintings. Hey, don't touch those. It's okay. I'm just looking. I'm just looking. Ah, Apollo, look at this one. Looks like half finished. Eh, looks like half finished. You can still see the rough sketch underneath. But that's all. The rough part doesn't look like the rest of painting at all. Yeah, good point. That is odd. Save three. Are these are the paintings have a really different style too? Ah, I thought I might find you two here. Long time no see! Oh? Seems like I ran into you far too often. I bet I know why you're here too. You know about the trial simulation tomorrow? I heard about it, sure. So Mr. Wade, Mr. Wade chose you, huh? We don't even know what the case is about. Well, he was killed, the artist who owns the studio that is. Mr. Drew Misham. Misham? His daughter was put under arrest. Yeah, we just saw her at the detention center. It was funny though. She seems more like a victim than the kind of person who could commit murder. We don't say. Not even by poisoning. That's how it was done, you know. Poisoning is a common way to get the job done when the murderer is a woman. Po poisoning? Anyway, Mr. Wright told me you'll be coming. Feel free to take a look around. I'll just be over here with my snackus. We can talk to anyone related to the case this time around. Which means we better find out as much as we can at here at the scene. Or else. Save 3. Oh, that's weird. There is a computer thing in that. Oh, it's not a computer. It's a sketch. Okay. We'll talk. I, want to, I, I know we can talk to the to Emma, but I just want to see what her response if we still want to talk to her about the case. So this um Drew Miss Ham was some kind of artist. Apparently did a lot of illustration for books I hear. Had a lot of female fans too, for what it's worth. Oh, well I guess his stuff is kind of pretty. Like that oil painting over there for instance. Um, yeah, that wasn't one of his illustration actually. Uh, so if what? So it was a standalone painting or something? Is that what she means? He was an odd bird, Miss Ham. Hadn't shown his face to anyone until the end. What do you mean to anyone? He was always locked up here in the studio apparently. His only connection to the outside world was through letters he put in that letterbox there. Letters? Do people still write letters? What do you mean, Apollo? I mean, when was the last time you wrote a, red, a real letter? Letter. Do most people use email and stuff these days? Not Mr. Misham can stand technology, it seems. He did everything by mail. Maybe he thought that way was more artistic, artistic you know? In any case, the only person betrayed him allowed in here. 
Oh, six daughter pera. Save three. Oh, you mean the killer? The suspect, please. We took some fingerprints, of course. The only ones found in the room were Mr. Misham and Vera, basically. Basically? Actually, last night, Mr. Misham gave an interview to a reporter for the first time. It happened during that interview, apparently. His first interview ever? Could you tell us a bit more about what happened the night of the murder? Independent. So, this woman, Vera. She's Mr. Misham's daughter, right? Yep, a real sickly girl ever since she was little. Hardly ever, hardly ever went outside. She did kind of a gift of a withdrawn sort of aura. She was homeschooled by her father apparently. It was quite a scene when they took her to the detention center. She was screaming about how she died if they took her outside. That does sound like the scene. In the end, she agreed to leave if she was allowed her good luck charm for company. Her good luck charm? Apparently, she has this charm that magically give her the courage to go outside. Why cannot ever I ever get normal client? But why would a shutting daughter kill her own dad? Don't look at me. So, about the potion, it was one to be in his coffee, right? No. Not precisely. Save 3 Not precisely? What does that mean? It means see, your, see for yourself, I think. The night of the crime? Like I said, last night was the first time someone from the outside come, came into this studio. I guess mysterious painters who never go outside make for good articles. And it just so happened that he died the night of his first interview. At around 9 p.m. every night, Vera always met him a cup of coffee. Last night he drank his usual coffee and suddenly become violently ill. And that and died. She poisoned him on the night of his interview. Won the reporter see? He wasn't near Mr. Miss Ham when he, she brought her father his coffee. He was checking out some equipment in the back of the room. Supposedly, that's why she didn't notice he was there. It was the reporter who called the police, in fact. Wait, but why is she the suspect? If anyone is suspicious, it's the reporter. Yet the reporter never got near Mr. Misham coffee. Even Vera acknowledged that. Regardless, I want to know about, more about this reporter. True. Okay, let me see. In time to examine. Wait, let me uh, okay. examine. I will mind taking a closer look at those paintings. Oh, I just love oils, you know how they're so thick. Is that the word? This painting all are all dry. I'm just surprised at how different these all are. Yeah, and what's going on with this half finished one? It must have been a work in progress. You can still see the rough sketch below. That's what's so weird. The sketch part doesn't really fit the finished part. I've noticed. That is weird. Hmm. Hey! There's a, there's a painting hidden back here. Hey, you're right. What if it's embracing somehow and he didn't want anyone to see it? You certainly seem pleased by the possibility. Safe 3. Huh! Ah, it's so normal. There's hardly something to get mind about. Huh. Ah, what is it, Apollo? Well, doesn't this painting look like. Never mind. Hmm? I better get a professional opinion on this. Wait, I, I, I think I know what you mean here. Mm. 
Ah. I see, I see. Examine. Ah, that's the fixed team's coffee mug. Aha! So the poison was in here! This is my first time seeing a real poison mug of coffee. I would hope so. Poison coffee? Not exactly, actually. What do you mean? No traces of poison more found in the coffee. What? You have to figure out the rest yourself. I'm officially not on your side after all. Okay. Imagine this coffee cup was for guests to use. Guess? Did the police already analyze this cup too? And the trace of poison was found on that cup. So the killer was after Do Misham alone. Hmm. Hey Apollo! That's where the body was! That's the spot where Mr. Do Misham passed away. 